so guys now i have seen a lot of people online complaining that each time they plug their color slide generator with nepa light or with light it is always showing a red light here which means that it's not charging a red light here that means that it's not charging okay now in this video i want to show you or i want to tell you what is causing that each time you plug this generator with light where this red light is appearing just like this you can see it right now why is it appearing and how can you solve this very problem with charging color solar generator now let me show you how you can solve it okay guys now if you look inside my house you can see there's nepal light you can see right there's actually nepal light and i want to plug this color solar generator so as i said earlier at where i live my transformer there's always low voltage so each time i plug this color solar generator with nepal light it doesn't charge so i think that's what some of you may be experiencing too in your areas maybe you have low voltage in your own areas too as in, in your transformers now you can see here is the um here is the charger where you can charge with nepal you can see it right here's my solar is off now i want to try to charge with nepal so i will see if that red light will appear somewhere around here or here you can see the socket the light is on this off on if i come here at the bottom here to this ac input here and plug here you can see right here it's not charging this red light is showing so it means that it's not charging now why is this red light showing this thing is showing is because there is low voltage it is saying that the voltage is not enough to charge this cooler solar generator. So anywhere you are and you have or you experience this red light, means that your light or your NEPA or your gen is very low and it can't charge this solar. And if you keep doing it, it might destroy the coil. So for me, how do I charge my cooler solar generator? You can see since my light is low, all the appliances in my house I use stabilizers for my AC and for my fridge there. So now to charge my color generator easily, I will unplug it from here. And now I'll take it to where stabilizer. Let me bring the light here. You can see here's my fridge and it is plugged to my stabilizer. So to charge my color generator without that red line showing. So I'll come here. Now I will unplug my fridge from the stabilizer. Here's my fridge. I will unplug it. Then I'll bring the charger for the solar and plug here. Then I'll bring the cable right here and plug it. Once I plug it, you can see right now it is charging. This blue light will start blinking. So it means that because the light normally is low, but with stabilizer, stabilizer helps to step up the voltage or the current and gives it a stability. So it means that with this low light, if you plug it, you will see a red light, which means that the red light is not able to power up. The nepa is too low to charge this very 1 kVA stabilizer. You can see it right. So you said it right now. So, guys, if you are anywhere experiencing the same issue, please try and use stabilizer. This is my 2000 watt stabilizer. You can also charge this with your 5000 watt stabilizer. All depends. You can see it right. So, right now it's charging and it will charge very faster. So, guys, I think this video was impactful. All right, guys. Thank you, guys, and see you guys in my next video. Bye.